Hey guys, let me just say that I really love Kirishima. He has such a cheerful personality. He seems very caring and would be very loving towards his partner. Do you ever wonder why Kirishima was the one who suggested saving Bakugo themselves? Like, why him specifically? Was it because he developed a stronger bond with Bakugo compared to the others? Was it because he felt guilty he couldn't save him? Why would he do such a reckless thing instead of waiting for the pro heroes to rescue him? I mean, he's just a friend, right? Unless... Oh, I ship Kiribaku, by the way. I just like the dynamic between them. And Kirishima isn't just a doormat. He's not some uwu soft boy that lets Bakugo walk all over him. No, he tells Bakugo to watch his mouth and to stop acting out on his own. He's someone that meets him head on, and Bakugo can actually respect someone like that. He's his unyielding horse, someone who doesn't break down, someone who's stupidly strong. Man, I am really starving for some Kiribaku breadcrumbs here. So today, I had the inspiration and confidence for drawing Kirishima. I've always been scared of Kirishima's dumb porcupine hair. He can fit a fish in there. I've actually drawn Kirishima with his hair down. Have you seen him? He's the reference for my boyfriend. At the time, my boyfriend had this weird hairstyle and I couldn't draw it properly. I mean, he still does, but... I started on a webcomic about a relationship. Not published, by the way. And I chose Kirishima's old hairstyle to save his secret identity. And so I just kept the style. I really want a Kirishima in my life. There are actually quite a few videos about Kirishima and Bakugo's relationship. And some compilation videos about them just talking, interacting with each other. They're like 5 to 10 minutes long, and it's from each season too, so that's a lot of moments. My boyfriend and I talk about Boku no Hero ships, and he knows how much I like Kirishima, and how Kiribaku is my main ship in the show. But, but, something he said that really ticked me off was when I said I thought Ida and Uraraka would be shipped together because when I first saw them, I thought their personalities fit together pretty well. The cute, bubbly, funny girl with the studious class president. I preferred that to Midoriya and Uraraka because then we'd have two bubbly idiots in love. That's nice and all, but it doesn't grab my interest. It's not really my cup of tea. What my boyfriend said was, I thought Bakugo and Uraraka had more chemistry. I guess he was saying this as a joke or something, but meh. I just stared at him dead in the face with the most unimpressed look. Okay, I don't care if you do ship Kachiko and don't like Hiribaku, we all have our own preferences. Just don't attack each other or over stupid things like ships. If you're taking negative thoughts, shut up and be on your way. Anyways, I'm getting off track. I just felt myself dissociate. Sometimes he says and does the stupidest things that make me question our relationship. Ugh, I'm sorry I turned this rant all depressive and angsty. Let's bring it back to Kirishima. I love him. I love him so much. Whenever I see him and hear his voice, it immediately brings a smile to my face. Have you ever felt that way towards someone? That person is just there and you immediately have heart eyes for them? You give 200% of your attention to them. I want that. When will my husband return from the war? Well, that's it everyone. Bye. Have a nice day. Hope you enjoy my ranting.